Designed for durability, your Von Duprin vertical rod exit device protects your building and the people who use it. To provide fire and life safety, the exit device must be properly adjusted. Vertical rod devices can come out of adjustment for a variety of reasons. Possible causes include physical abuse from carts and equipment, weather and temperature changes, missing through bolts or rod guides, or improper installation. Your vertical rod may be out of adjustment if you find your door won't latch or relatch, your door is difficult to open, or there are drag marks from the bottom latch bolt on your floor surface. Keep in mind there may be other factors affecting your door's performance, such as frame alignment or hinge wear. Before you check the surface vertical rod device for proper adjustment, confirm the position and operation of the strike. To determine if your device is out of adjustment, look to see if both the top and bottom latch bolts are held retracted when the door is opened. Adjusting the rods is simple when you follow the steps we are about to show you. Only a few basic tools are required. A Phillips head screwdriver, a small step ladder, and something to prop the door open. It's important to check the operation of the top latch first because it controls the operation of both the top and bottom latches. Begin with the door propped open. Remove the center case cover, the latch case covers, and the rod guides. Then disconnect the bottom rod by detaching it from the center case assembly. You must disengage the bottom rod to properly adjust the top rod. Cycle the door. Check the top of the door to determine if the top latch is fully retracted. The latch bolt should be flush with the top of the latch while the dead latching triggers are extended. If the latch bolt is not fully retracted, you need to adjust the top rod. To make an adjustment, detach the top rod from the center case assembly. Rotate the top rod in a clockwise direction to shorten the length or in a counterclockwise direction to make it longer. Once you have made an adjustment, reattach the top rod, cycle the door, and check for full latch retraction. If you don't have full latch retraction, repeat the adjustment process until you do. Next, check to be sure the top latch is dead latching properly. With the door propped open and the latch bolt in its retracted position, depress the dead latching triggers, extending the latch bolt. Now press on the latch bolt. You should not be able to retract it if dead latching is working properly. If the latch bolt does retract, further rod adjustments are needed. Repeat the process until you have both full latch retraction and dead latching. Reattach the bottom rod by inserting it into the center case assembly. Cycle the door again. Check the top latch to confirm that it remains retracted and dead latched. Then examine the bottom latch bolt. Ideally, the bottom latch bolt should be flush with the bottom of the door. If it extends more than 1 16th of an inch below the bottom edge of the door, you will need to adjust it. To adjust the bottom rod, go back to the center case and detach the bottom rod. Next, rotate the bottom rod clockwise to shorten the rod or counterclockwise to lengthen the rod. Once you have made an adjustment, reattach the bottom rod to its position and cycle the door again. Always check the top latch first to verify that it retracts and dead latches. Then check the bottom latch bolt to see if your adjustment was successful. Cycle the door two to three more times, checking both the top latch and bottom latch on each cycle to ensure the rods are accurately adjusted and the door is operating properly. Then replace latch case covers, the center case cover, and rod guides. That's all there is to adjusting the Von Duprin 9899 series surface vertical rod exit device. For more information or to contact your local Ingers Oil manufacturer or call on our customer service line at 877-671-7000.